Hey guys, it's Ryan from Green Tech Network. I've decided to start a series in which I review different apps from the Google Play Store. When I was coming up with which apps to review, I noticed that some of the apps actually require Flash Player, and that Flash Player is no longer available on the Google Play Store. So I decided to make this quick tutorial on how to install Flash on your own. To test if you have Flash installed, basically just open up your web browser and then go to this website. I'll include the link in the description. If you see a gray box or a little blue Lego shaped kind of thing, that basically means that Flash Player is not installed. Um, if Flash Player is installed, you should see a little like animation with a ball rolling around. So because Flash Player is not available to be downloaded on the Google Play Store, you're going to have to manually download and install the Flash Player APK yourself. I've already gone ahead and hooked up my phone with my micro USB cable to transfer over the files, so you're going to want to do that too. After you do that, you want to open up the Adobe Archived Flash Player Versions website. I'll include a link in the video description and I'll also put a video annotation up to, so you can access this also. Um, you want to scroll down until you see the Flash Player for Android 4.0 archives and Flash Player for Android 2.x and 3.x archives and you want to download whichever Android build you have, obviously. Apparently the 4.0 archives also work for Android 4.1 and 4.2, but I can't vouch for that personally because my phone is 4.0. So you want to click on whichever one you want to download. The top ones are the most recent, so I'm going to click on this one. You wait for it to download and browse to the download directory. Show in folder. And then I already have a few other ones downloaded, but you want to open up my computer and go to either your phone's internal storage or your phone's SD card storage. I'm putting it on my phone's SD card storage and you can put it in whatever folder you want to. I'm putting it in the download folder and then you just drag and drop. Once you download and put the Flash Player APK on your phone, you want to open up the Play Store and search for an APK installer. The one that I use shows up as the first result when you search APK installer. It has that cardboard box as the icon and it's by a company called Potentia Mobile Apps. In my opinion this is the smoothest and easiest to use APK installer. I've gone through a few different ones and this is definitely the easiest one to use. After you've installed the APK installer application open it up and then search for the Flash Player 11 APK. Mine is inside the external SD folder and then inside the downloads folder all the way at the very bottom. To open and install the APK all you need to do is tap on it and then you can read through the installation changes and then press the install button. You can give it a few seconds to install and once it's done installing you can press on the open button in the bottom right. This will open up um, some settings that Flash Player lets you change. It does take a few seconds to open up sometimes. And if you see this page, that usually means that the installation was successful. But to further test it, go to that website that we went to prior to the installation. And this time, instead of seeing a gray box or blue Lego thing, you should see the little animation with the ball rolling around. So there you have it. How to install Flash Player 11 on the Android operating system without using the Google Play Store. If you have any questions, comments, feedback, etc., be sure to leave it in the comment box or send me a private message. Thanks for watching and please stay tuned for my future Android app reviews.